Happy New Year. Welcome to 2023. It is a beautiful day in southern Missouri. Missouri, Missouri, whatever. A 1953 Ford Crown Victoria popped up two-door coupe. It popped up pretty cheap, so I'm going to go down and take a look at it. I thought that y'all would want to come with me. Let's go. So I had to come here and get my dealer tag in case I do buy this car. But let me tell you what I know about the car first. It's a 1953 Ford Crown Victoria 50th Anniversary Edition. Uh, they said that they pulled the six cylinder motor out and put a reliable 302 in this car. Well, uh, that suits me better because I am on the side of reliability and drivable instead of keeping it all original. I want a car that I can hop in and drive. They said they also put new brake lines, new brakes, new calipers, rotors, all that stuff. Uh, updated the car a little bit and uh, a new battery. So we'll see. Um, we're going to go out there. I'm going to take you out with me, of course. We're going to go out there. We're going to look at the car. And uh, I'm going to see if I can get it pretty cheap. Y'all ready? I'm ready. And they say it runs and drives. So we're going to see. And if I don't buy it, at least we will get a test drive in this 1953 Ford Crown Victoria. Let's go. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Going through the sky, little Einstein. Well, he said, see, these are country directions, okay? He said, take a left on Rainbow. Maybe and you're Let's buy this house. Yuck. I don't like that house. That it's house. Right the corner, it's so what? It's, it's a ugly. It's that is car. no good car lot here. Okay, let's concentrate on the Ford, okay? Concentrate on the Ford. Okay, you can speed up by going more than five miles an hour, Lily. Okay. He said. I see it. I see it. I see it. Is it a blue car? I okay, see it. there it is. That's it. You see it? Yes. Okay. It's an old car. Let's go see it. I see the blue car next to the big truck. And there it is. Next to the big truck. It's a. Uh, I found it. Huh. Okay, there we go. There it is right there. Cool looking car. So it's from Wisconsin? Yeah. Okay, so what they did, uh, whoever had it before you, uh, there, there was a big hole in the bottom of the frame, oh, uh -huh. and then they put a piece of quarter inch uh, steel on the bottom to cover it up. Underneath and welded. Uh, it. Yeah, well. and uh, so what they did was try to strengthen it. Well, uh, yeah. fantastic looking car I mean the body the lines are great uh, the chrome is really good yeah I mean really good the glass is good the top is good uh, well I'm well yeah it's a little bit of uh, I don't know how good it is I mean they're gonna have to tear it off the seat yeah but unfortunately a little bit too rusty for me man because yeah. yeah. well, I that's fine uh, <sighs> I bought it for just a project, and, uh, and I, uh, at my age, I don't know if I'm going to do it. Unfortunately, the guy has lost touch with reality. I was told there was very, very minimum rust. I get there, 
and it's rusted completely underneath that car. It was a teetotal piece of junk, uh, not safe to be on the road today. Um, it looked okay from about 10 feet, but uh, as you get closer, oh my goodness, the top is rusted, floor pans are rusted. It's like a, a Fred Flintstone vehicle. It is absolutely insane. Absolutely insane. Uh, not worth 1500 bucks. Well, you win some, you lose some. The whole point of this video is you must go see with your own eyes. Do not take the customers or the person who is trying to sell the vehicles word for it. Absolutely not. He told me it had very minimal rust. I get down there and shit, it's like it's falling apart. I, I would be scared to drive that car down the street. And if I did, parts of the car would have fell off. Um, I guess the beauty is in the eyes of the beholder, or in this case, the condition is in the eyes of the holder of the piece of shit car. Anyway, that's okay. You move on, you go to the next one. Uh, you've been there, done that, and at least you've seen it and how now you have learned from it. So please like, follow, share, comment, and do all the other things. Happy New Year, guys. I hope you enjoyed my first video of this year. Peace out.